All right, so what we are doing today is we are starting with the basics. Um, forgive me, I'm losing my voice. I just was talking to family a ton the past few days. All right, you can see me okay. So I just got here, but I know what I want to start with with Petty. So I want you guys to start this just in your daily practice with them, two to five to 10 minutes. So first, let's just go over the tools that I'm going to be using um, during his stay. Of course, you guys know about the recall leash. So I'm going to be using that. Um, if I need to, just for safety, I might be using a slip lead. This is not meant to choke. This is not meant to um, dominate your dog. This is for safety, and this is for quick, easy corrections. Um, I'll show you all how it works really quick. It just goes like this back here. I, I'm pretty sure we've talked about this, Brittany, but... Um, you know, um, it's been a few days, so just clips. Come here, Ted. Just clip. Oh, it doesn't clip. It just sets right back here, and the correction is just ah, just like that. That's it. Come on, come on. So you can start putting boundaries on them with the leash, with this leash, with another leash, um, whatever it is, what your comfort level is. This is essentially like training wheels, but for a dog. Okay. So come on, let's go. And then Cameron, like you said, when you give him that extra little push to go in the crate, that's what this is used for too. Come on, good. So I'm just gonna start with this then. I'm just gonna drop the leash. I'm gonna let him do the thing. I'm gonna let him get used to it. We're gonna start with nose, eyes, ears, hot spot. okay? So he's kind of trying to figure it out. But what I wanna do is I wanna boost him up the whole time. So Ted. What do you say? Good. All right, come on. Good. So get his attention with his nose. Ah. Yes. Gonna be looking for eye contact through the fourth, <laughs> you know, um, during his stay with me. And then ears. Yes. Good job, buddy. So I'm just getting him used to it. Right now I'm using some jerky. He seems to like it. Yeah, he started taking treats a few minutes after I got here. Good hot spot. Good. So I'm just getting to teach him the manners of what I'm doing. Notice like I'm just walking around. All right, here I go around the way. That front door or that front window that you guys have is open and it is doing, he, he did really well looking out of it, of course. You see right here, I'm teaching him spatial relations. Good boy. And of course, he's going to naturally want to go to his bed. So he starts just getting used to that. He starts getting used to focusing on me. That's where all the magic happens. That's where everything happens. See, look, I'm able to look up. He's not biting my hand. Okay, break. Let's go. So luring, nose, eyes, yes, ears. And yes, that what ears do and that yes creates a little snapshot for him, a little picture of a good, okay, awesome. And then I'm going to work on some crab hands, backing up. Good. Get him in a spot. Good boy. All right. I'm just going to walk away. I want to start going all around the house. I want to get him used to good, excellent work. Just making that eye contact with me before he just reacts and wants to run outside and run around the back door. But, you know, yeah, I can see... Uh, through the window that it's closed. I have a clicker belonging to me for a couple days here. Nice job. Good boy. And I'm just getting him used to communicating better. Just manners. You don't really, honestly, guys, you don't have to use treats too terribly much. Hot spot. Or you can say bed, whatever. I mean, you know, I, that's just what I've been calling it the past several weeks. Ah, we're going to work on door manners another time, but I'm just kind of hinting at it. A lot of this going on. There he is. <laughs> Alright, come on, go to your spot. Ah, so he jumped upon the windowsill. We're going to give him an off. Good boy, let him know what my boundaries are right there. 
and keeping him sequestered to my box, to my bubble. So see, ah, 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 because I don't want him to be trying to get ahead of me. I see this so much with dogs, like how he's trying to lead me outside to the yard. No, come on. See, I didn't even have to do anything. Good boy. <laughs> and he's already starting on touch targeting. He's got such a funny face. I love it. It's so cute. Come on. You see I'm working the angles on him? Good. So nose. Get his attention with his nose. His eyes. Yes. And ears. So let's move on a little bit. Okay. You see he's a quick learner. He's a quick, quick, quick uh, dog. Got a really great noggin on him. So... What we're going to pivot to now is just really talking about that little grace period here, or that little waiting period, excuse me. Yes, just like that. Teaching him to make him wait. Good boy. back. Let's see. And he's going to start capturing this behavior right here. Watch. And what capturing means is doing it on his own. Good boy. All right. I'm going to go to this back door again. So I'm going to solicit it. Good. And what I mean by soliciting eye contact, it's going to be kind of just looking for it around the house. Yes. Good. And he just kind of, <laughs> look at my forehead, kind of, <laughs> kind of looked at me up like that. Well, he's just not really moving his head too much. Good. So now let's take this off here for these last couple minutes. Notice I barely even had to use it with him. Um, but it, it's really for safety, okay? That's not to be a butthead at all. You know, I just, I don't want people to get the wrong idea with these things right here. It's an amazing tool. I can even use one of these. There you go. There you go, guy. Yeah, nice job, buddy. Nice job. So, this is what I do a lot. I let him be a dog. But I know how to find my moments so he can have fun. Good. And he's over here solving problems, being cool. I just gave him a ball to play with. So, you know, essentially what I want him to be doing now, you know, and you're going to see me using tugs as a reward. Okay. Ball. Tree. Affection. Hand targeting. Lots of different ways that he can start to communicate with us. Okay. Okay. And start to find reward rather than just a treat, <laughs> you know. And he, he's still learning, as you guys know. He's still developing. Like, he just went under this table and knocked over your sweet potatoes. Um, stuff like that. So, he's progressing. He's going to still be progressing after this board and train scenario. But what we are working on is that impulse control. <gasps> that kind of stuff. Him responding to that. Hey, staying in my bubble. Good job, kiddo. Good boy. Making it very low threshold, very low stakes, so that he's starting to learn and level up each day. That's the goal. Tomorrow is going to be working on some stuff in your backyard. We're going to have more sun all day, so we're going to let that all that water dry up that we got over the past few days. And then we're going to start going out there. Maybe even your driveway. I'm going to be like pretty much like triple leashing him. Um, for that, I'm going to be, you know, having him on his harness. I'm going to have him on the slip lead. And I may even have him on a recall leash because he won't be able to get, get in front of me. So, um, so let's, yeah, 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 yeah. Good. 
Good. So see, finding a motivator, just like that. Good boy. And I've kind of lost the power of my voice over these past couple days. So um, I've got to find some different teaching tools. But we're 10 minutes in. I'm going to send you guys this via text. Uh, if you ever have any questions about these videos, like let me know. I can always add to them. I'm sure I left a couple of things out. But for him, this is what I'm happy seeing. This is what we're working on today while I'm here. Um, I don't have any plans. I'm going to watch some World Cup. <coughs> Hang out with him. Grab some food. Chill. It's going to be great. So thank you guys. I love him to pieces already. And um, it's going to be a great few days. Um, so take care. Bye-bye.